These days, shopping for a new car often feels like you need a six-figure salary just to get started. A budget of $25,000 used to open the door to a wide range of sedans, hatchbacks, and even a few crossovers. Today, it barely gets you into the market at all. Thanks to inflation, the shift in consumer preferences toward massive SUV and pickup trucks, and automakers' hunger for higher margins, the affordable car is practically a relic of the past. The situation is even worse when you turn toward electric vehicles, EV. Despite the increasing push for electrification and incentives meant to promote cleaner transportation, EV in the United States still carry a steep price tag. The average EV now costs around $59,000, according to industry reports. Yes, battery prices are slowly declining as technology improves, and yes, competition is gradually heating up, but the reality is clear. EV remain a luxury for many Americans. This is exactly why a new EV startup called Slate Auto is generating serious buzz. Reportedly backed by billionaire Amazon founder Jeff Bezos, among other deep-pocketed investors, Slate Auto is positioning itself as a potential game-chainer in a bloated and expensive automotive market. The company is rumored to be working on an all-electric compact pickup truck that will cost just $25,000. That's right. In an era where full-size electric trucks like the Ford F-150 Lightning and Rivian R1T regularly cross the $70,000 mark, Slate Auto is promising an EV pickup at a fraction of the cost. If the company can deliver on that vision, it could shake the EV world to its core and bring genuine affordability back to the market. But what do we actually know about Slate Auto so far? Not much, at least not yet. Details about the company's origins, vehicle specifications, battery sourcing, and production plans remain under tight wraps. However, a recent teaser from Newsweek, part of its new, Disruptors, issue, offers a brief glimpse at what the company is working on. And by, glimpse, we mean a literal sliver of the vehicle. Looks like we are well into this video we would like to welcome you to the Electric Explorer, your go-to spot for all things electric. We dive deep into the world of electric vehicles, from the latest models and tech to industry trends and sustainability efforts. Whether you're an EV enthusiast, or just starting to explore, we've got you covered with reviews, news, and insights that will keep you plugged into the future of driving. So, hit that subscribe button, buckle up, and let's charge forward together. The teaser image shows close-up shots of what appears to be a boxy, rugged body design, cloaked in a clever camouflage wrap bearing Newsweek's branding. It hints at a compact yet purposeful truck, with round headlights set into a wide, rectangular black grille, a look reminiscent of the Ford Bronco, or Land Rover Defender, rather than the sleek, minimalist styling favored by brands like Tesla. The design language suggests a utilitarian approach, something that's both capable and accessible, not just another tech-laden spaceship on wheels. Beyond that, Slate Auto remains an enigma. We don't know the vehicle's range, battery size or chemistry, drivetrain layout, or performance capabilities. Nor do we know where the vehicles will be built, how many models Slate plans to offer, or what kind of charging infrastructure partnerships might be in place. Even so, the idea alone, a truly affordable of truck, is enough to spark excitement across the industry. Newsweek notes that Slate is aiming to beat Tesla to the punch with an inexpensive compact electric vehicle for the everyman. That's no small goal. While Tesla has promised for years to deliver a budget-friendly EV, most notably the elusive $25,000 Model 2, such a vehicle has yet to materialize. Tesla's current lineup remains firmly in the premium space, with even the so-called entry-level Model 3 starting around $40,000 before incentives. If Slate Auto can leapfrog Tesla and launch a compelling EV at half that price, it won't just disrupt the electric pickup segment, it could become a cornerstone of the mass-market EV revolution. Of course, there are huge challenges ahead. Building a vehicle from the ground up is notoriously difficult, and doing so on a tight budget is even harder. Startup automakers often face hurdles around supply chains, manufacturing scalability, regulatory approvals, and customer acquisition. Even well-funded companies like Lucid and Fisker have struggled to ramp up production and meet delivery targets. But Slate has one major advantage, capital. With Jeff Bezos reportedly backing the company, Slate Auto may have the resources to weather early challenges, and secure the kind of partnerships needed to move fast. Access to Amazon's logistics expertise, or cloud computing through AWS, for example, could offer significant operational advantages as Slate builds out its infrastructure. More details are expected to drop on April the 24th, when Slate Auto is reportedly planning a larger reveal. That could include full images of the vehicle, 
technical specs, and, hopefully, a clear look at the company's roadmap. Until then, we're left with speculation and a lot of excitement. Still, the idea of a $25,000 electric pickup truck is enough to stir the imagination. For millions of drivers priced out of the EV market, such a vehicle could be the breakthrough they've been waiting for. And for the auto industry, it could be a much-needed reminder that innovation doesn't always have to come with a luxury price tag. If Slate Auto can deliver on even half its promise, it may end up being the most important automotive story of the year.